Hey, what's good, man? It's your boy, Little Johnny, and I'm here doing the Bodega Boys intro because I wanted to go on a show that was lit and would not abuse me. I did not come here to get yelled at by old black bald niggas, even though that's what Jesus and Meryl's going to do anyway. You know, when I went to that show, it was cool as Minnesota, and they had no respect for me. I told them that I had an Xbox 360 deal, and they made fun of me. But now I'm here with the Bodega Boys, and it's fucking lit. Yo, Jesus, bro, y'all got to be in my next Target ad. I fuck with y'all heavy. Do the fucking drop. It's lit. Episode 63. This shit is so lit. The man is so fucking strong. Live from Red Bull Studios, New York. Episode <laughs> <laughs> 61. That's right. It's the most dangerous podcast in the world. 61. Excuse me. 63. Damn. Damn. You know what it is? I, I listen. I don't know numbers anymore. Yo, I don't know little numbers. I only know big numbers. I feel like we're both. It's very early in the morning. It's very early in the morning. <laughs> We've been running very hard. 100 episodes yesterday. You already Popping know. Popping the jet to no, Vegas. No, it's uh, not a game. Different. Everything is different. I can't keep track of little numbers. Come I'm on. A, you know what? I'm, I'm listen. I used to laugh at people that like. Didn't answer their texts. Mm-hmm. Like I used to laugh at people. Like, oh, you got twenty unread texts. <laughs> Yo, you what are you fucking? What are you supermodel? <laughs> no, you get it now. You get it. It's draining. It's oh, draining to tell people man. every day. Yo, I'm busy. Damn, I don't have time to hang with y'all. I'm sorry. Damn. Well, you know what my name is, ma. <laughs> my name is Jesus Nice, aka Jesus Vice, aka Yo Chipotle, aka Fat Lip Fat Lip Cereal, aka Fast Force Lean, just aka Eli Lippy, Butchers Butchers Gully, Slow Down, I know you, but Young Gay Party, Young Take, DJ Fuego, Mister Nando's with a Rambo, Mio Nova Santa Noventa Equato, Mikael going off the Juve, that's right. Look complete. Put up for forty with Shorty, aka Don't Talk to Me in the Overall. I don't know you. The reason my plus one got plus one, so don't make a fuss. Don't. Jesus Rossi, the Jamaican Jew. It's a nice guy. Amazing. Amazing. Jamaican avocado toast, Young Pop, the Costa Mufasa. AK Chili the Mode, left handed reliever for the Yankees, Kalo K. You see uh, Aaron Judge. Hey, he's a little bit of a little bit of my bat, you know. Vice K. Makuzaka. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Jones. These are X Machina, J Chuckles, Daily Cups, the Human Doctor Bomb is labeled. Daily, Daily, Daily. 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 Daily
Big Bowler brand. Yeah. Okay, shout out to the Le- 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 <laughs> Shout out to the Bowl family. Shout out to the Bowl family. They're really trying to ball out here. They're trying to Because they're selling low top Kobe knockoffs for $500. For, what? $495. Four ninety five. Don't yeah. put fake news out there. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That's I it. mean, plus tax. You plus look at that half a half $20 for the slides. You know what I'm saying? I'm not laughing too hard. How much are the Gucci slides? The Gucci slides are uh, less than that. The Gucci slides, you could get the Gucci slides. Like a buck fifty? Uh, what's the Gucci slide going for? One ninety. One ninety. Wow. Okay. Okay. If you really want to ball, out. the problem with the Gucci slides is when you have a pair, and then you go to the bodega, and three other niggas got a pair. Only one of y'all got a real pair. Yeah. And the hood rap the street can't tell the difference. They so can't. Why you don't care. That money. That's terrible. That They're not gonna money? look at the stitching. Mm-mm. They're not gonna look at the detail to attention to detail. But I feel like you in the future is not far off that I can see you late at night while smacked on Instagram live with a big piece of clay yeah. as you're modeling the Miro <laughs> three thousands for your kids. Oh man. Available at boys Listen, and girls. Don't get me hyped. The only basketball sneakers you could also tend the garden and clean your burrow with. <laughs> Don't get me hype. Popular DR. Don't get me hype. Daughter just made a month. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to her. And I'm really might be the next Lavar Ball. Like I'm looking at him like, you are the prototype. You know what I'm saying? Like, sick of the, sick of the street store. Like, why I gotta I gotta pay someone else for sneakers? I can make my I'm own. Oh shit! You know what I'm saying? My own. You know what I mean? Like, what? How hard is it? What? It's just basically you take a potato, you stick your foot in it. Yeah, that's it. all. Put go, a lack on it. go to China, you know what I'm saying? Talk to some people, you know what I mean? If you see Miro at Garden State Mall, his kids got on potato shoes. You already know don't what it call, is. Don't call children's services. No, it's He's not potato shoes, nigga. It's the Miro the 250s. Miro 250s. Get stock <laughs> drop in Saturday at 10 o'clock. Get your fucking you box ready. <laughs> They're going to sell out immediately. they not on the confirmed app. <laughs> they be tapping their fingers like, Yo, what's up? I'm going to get this. 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 i am going to get this 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 i am going to Jordan, since you saw growing up, with like maybe a lightning bolt behind. That's what them. I'm saying. Like, yo, are you automatically taking an L if you come out with your own sneaker that's not Nike Adidas? Because what I feel like, no matter what you design, if it's not something that's referencing something that's already out there, it's gonna be so wild that people are gonna be like, "What the fuck is that?" True. You know what I mean? Unless like you're getting a sneaker for like kids who have no reference. Kids don't know like the 92 Jordans right, right, or like right. all that shit. So Fuck maybe it. that's why I think they were fucking with like the stuff Curry's because they never they thought, oh, this shit's cool. This shit's just cool. We, nigga, we old, stuff, nigga. Like, yo, this shit's whack. Oh, this nigga. Just, yeah, niggas had the Wolverine boots, nigga. Fuck out. Like everyone in school has these. I was like, well, everyone in school is a little hurt. Yeah. How about that? If everybody in school jumped off a bridge, would you do it? <laughs> you gotta start yeah. pulling your old kids and shit. <laughs> Drop them off the front, go around the back, push them out. Yeah, put these nerd. Put these LeBrons on, nigga. You look like my dad. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Eat that dirt. <laughs> yo. What's he doing? The, 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 the Steph Curry shimmy from the commercial? Yo. No. Yeah, I'm, yo, it's, and this shit started early, but it got dropped. Merrill Jr. off of school the other day, and the kids were staying outside because it, it wasn't time to go in yet. Mm-hmm. And they were all looking at each other's sneakers, and they're in kindergarten. Mm-hmm. And they were like, I got Nikes. I got Nikes. Do you got Nikes? And, I, and Adrian pulled up with the Kyrie twos. Mm-hmm. It was like, yo, yo, I'm saying, yo. I should got the strap. Y'all niggas, <laughs> y'all, niggas got the, y'all niggas got the DSW shit. Like, nigga, the what Nike hyper valve like, shit. What is that, <laughs> What the fuck is that? <laughs> Them shits ain't gonna help you run faster and jump higher. Niggas like, I run mad faster. These shits is like running suicides in the crib. I'm like, yeah. Yeah, get that, get that, yeah. Yeah, but them shits is $80. So, like, you holler at your boy, because if niggas grow half the size every month. Yo, it's the kid sneakers is ridiculous. It's crazy, bro. Like, or as we call them in the industry, grade school. <laughs> grade school? <laughs> is that what they're called? Grade school sizes. Uh, yes. Uh, nah, kid sneakers is... The price... They're like half of what an adult sneaker is. Mm-hmm. That's ridiculous. Mm-hmm. How long do they last? A couple months, B. If your kid is on... is on, is on, If your kid is a fast grower, you're buying new shoes every couple months. You know what I'm saying? The irony of life is... The worse you treat your kid and the future of their, the probably future outcome of the said baby, the better their sneakers. Oh. If you see a kid and like they got the soft Jordans that just dropped, you know they ain't gonna be shit. <laughs> <laughs> you know they gonna spend a lot of time with grandma yo, for while mama in the club. Yo, niggas, yo, yo, Dad's going to jail. Dog, if you drop your kid off and, and his classmate got the true religion suit, pfft, nigga. All right, <laughs> don't chill with him. If your baby got any Burberry, anything, yo, uh, the Instagram, nah. just give it to the cops now. He's a scammer. Yo, that's it. He's baby scammer. He's already scamming. His name is being used all over the place. All over the place. <laughs> 
How are you just coming out the womb with your credit is 348? It's fucking terrible. <laughs> 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 they're trying to get a Similac loan and shit. The like, yo, I'm gonna need a cash deposit if you want this percentage coming out. So, like, yo, I mean, listen, this is a little sketch. I mean, you I, could, him? <laughs> I could cut this cord, so but like, I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. You reneged on a couple of other things. You sir. feel me? So <laughs> I don't know, homie. Listen, that cradle cap ain't paying for itself. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Yo, shout out to all the Americans that lost their health insurance. Yo, shout out to y'all. Time to die. Do you want to die? <laughs> <laughs> Is that the song that plays? You, you go to Obamacare yes. website now? <laughs> Damn! When you gonna sign up? When, when you gonna sign up for Trump care? Obama was trying to help too. people. Trump is just like, guess what? I'm dying. We all we dying, all died. Nigga. Nigga. What's we up? all died. Yeah. I thought I would die on my golf course. <laughs> you, on the other hand, you gonna die with a mouthful of Mountain Dew, uh-huh. touching your opioid bike in your box. <laughs> Hope your auntie with no teeth doesn't take them from you. That's right. Oh man. See, you fucked up. That's what I'm saying. Like, look, this is it sucks, but at the same time, it's like. Y'all niggas deserve this because you voted for them, dude. Yeah, but the problem is the people. It affects everybody that didn't yeah, vote for them, which it, sucks. You know what I'm saying? It disproportionately I affects e. minorities and people of color. That's first. right. I.e., old you people that. Gonna die fast enough for one to die for mm-hmm. before them. Mm-hmm. I don't know. America's stupid. This is what they voted for. That's crazy. Your grandmother is, te- is going is gonna to die 10 years sooner now because of this nigga. And, yeah. Uh, Not see? even 10 years. Maybe, like, maybe right away. <laughs> you know what I mean? There's people on Twitter like, yo, I think. The GOP, their whole shit is like, yo, just open a GoFundMe, my nigga. You be all right. You be all right. <laughs> That's what you guys start. In waiting rooms, they just give you, they'll be like, yo, here's your URL. Please upload a good photo. Make the amount you want reasonable. Listen, and good luck. Good luck. Y'all better start stealing bottle waitress pictures from Instagram <laughs> and start opening them GoFundMe's because it's about to be quiet. The problem with GoFundMe's is I don't give money to people unless they're following me on uh, Twitter. That's number one True. rule. The other day, I was going to give some girl, some girl, it was like some heartbreaking story. I don't know if she didn't have a car to go to work or she needed money for like a dialysis or some shit. Yeah. And I was like, oh my God. I was like, yo, Damn. you know what I'm saying? I got yeah. a little, maybe even, instead of getting a pair of sneakers, I'll give this girl the money, right? I went and looked on her Twitter page and it was like, you are blocked. I was like, no, you know what the fuck is blocked? Your blessings, bitch. Hey, fuck out of here. I, nigga went back to that car like, the train. <laughs> <laughs> In fact, I took some money out of GoFundMe. <laughs> now I went like, report. <laughs> you saw the GoFundMe like, make this bitch late to work. <laughs> <laughs> Help me buy cars to slow down her commute. <laughs> If I just need a thousand dollars, I need a pickaxe. I'm gonna tear up her front lawn. Fuck that. Yo, like I I didn't even know what I did to get blocked by her. Listen, and now I did a search, and I was like, wait, I'm blocked by bad people. I have no idea. Like, I'm like, yo, you blocked. Like, who's losing in that situation? uh, Like, am I like, damn? I don't know what Firewalker uh, Sexy Jesse Seven Four Four said today on Twitter. (laughs) Like, you're gonna see my tweets regardless. They're coming through. I don't even look at all my text messages. What makes you think I'm looking at y'all niggas' tweets? Yeah. Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, come on. And then I like people who block me, like, back in, like, 2010. They, they must be hella confused. Uh, like, they don't know what the fuck's going on. They have no idea. No idea. Then imagine they just unblock me one day, like, let me see what this nigga's doing. And then they're like, oh, shit. There's a lot of people that have me blocked, and all they know of me is the avatar with the dog. <laughs> and they're like, yo, I love these and blah, blah, blah. You know, I'm like, same thing, nigga. <laughs> it's the same yeah. fucking person, nigga. You get the poison with the candy. It's like when you catfishing your girl and shit. <laughs> so her death threats at work. I'm like, I'll kill you, bitch. She's like, yo, I'm getting those messages. I'm like, nah, I got you, man. I got worry. you. Protect you. I'm like, niggas, no. You never, you never get the messages while I'm around, right? That's niggas, no. <laughs> Listen, it's a cheap Valentine's Day gift. <laughs> yo. Oh no! Maybe you should yeah. do it too. Yeah. Just yeah, some... send that nigga messages like, yo, this is your child and shit. Oh, Kevin shit. Wall under pressure. <laughs> he come home, just rub your hand in his chest hair like, you're a good dude. Uh, 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 uh. Dude, so constantly anime sweats. Oh shit. Oh man. Shout out to all you niggas out there scamming. Yo, shout out to Red Bull. It's a Red Bull Music Academy this week, this month. Yeah. yeah that that's why they got on. like I feel like that's why they got the wild decorations in the still. Like yeah. niggas doing the wild wall decals and shit. They have like speeches and shit. Yeah. They got performances. Come through, check it out. You know I mean? mentioned that because the podcast is a little shorter this week. Y'all were complaining last week. You was like, <gasps> was the podcast so short? And then it's like the week before it was like, yo. There was no podcast at all for three weeks, so uh, I feel like a deadbeat dad. It's like, yo, Saturday's not good enough, my nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, I gotta be here. I, gotta be I here, took you to get sneakers. Life. I got you the Kyrie. <laughs> <laughs> you think these big, these big baller brands pay for themselves? Yo, all right. Yeah, I'll be tired about pops. Who, who your mom's fucking now? <laughs> <laughs> Keep it real. Who's that dude? He's a, who that? Who that? Who's, that who's that? He don't play like he he make, he be like, he got money and shit. Yeah. Oh, where? 
Yo, tonight put some gum on the lock. I'm gonna hit you with the wild home invasion. <laughs> Don't worry, I got I'm, I, I got blanks. I'm not really gonna shoot you. I'm like, I'm gonna shoot my own kid. I think it's three years old. He's like, he's like, like daddy, he's dad. Like, he's like, <laughs> Michael? I'm like, my name's not Michael, nigga. <laughs> Damn! A Damn. sad, scary life. Yo, don't live a sad, scary life. I don't. I don't live a la- sad, scary life. I've actually lived a clean, good Christian life. Cr- <laughs> I try to be the black Tim Tebow. <laughs> I do all things through Christ and Red Bull. Shout out to Tim Tebow, who's out here apparently doing pretty well in the minor leagues. Is he doing well in the minor leagues? Uh, I mean, is he, I think or he's like God a single God is, God is like, God yo, is like, yo, let me God's like, yo, I dropped the ball on that whole Trump shit, so let me give these people a little hope. <laughs> Give him Yo, I'll give y'all Chibo. He woke up. He was like, "Oh shit! Oh, I was supposed to let Hillary win." Oh fuck! He, he was yeah. just like, "Yo, Chibo, yo, Tim, Chibo time." Yo, let's He's get like, it, Dad, baby. I'm going in, Dad. I, I, I put you can put yeah, me in, Dad. Yeah, it's back. Yeah, go, go ahead. Back. Yeah, go ahead. Swing at the second pitch. Go ahead. Go back. You're back, Chibo. You're back in my good graces. <laughs> I'm the left hand of the Lord. Blah, 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 blah. Watch, watch. I think I'm like, he's gonna help the Mets make like a, a run at the fucking pennant and shit, mm-hmm. and then he's just gonna, uh, I don't know. No, the final play is decide to pitch. It's gonna be like an out the park home run at like City Field. And like angel wings are gonna burst through the back of his jersey. It's like, ah! and he's gonna catch it and just go, I have to return to my father. <laughs> he just gets flying up. And all the best fans are like, fuck! Oh, fuck! Fuck! And that's a be, ground rule double and now! He's gonna be like, nah, that's an out. That's not a home run, that's an out. <laughs> Can you believe it? You just flew off with a ball in play. <laughs> The Mets season ends again. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. This is depressing. It's got to be sad to be a Mets fan. <laughs> it is kind of. I mean, the Mets, they, they started off strong, falling apart. Yo, the Yo, Mets always do. The Mets do what the Knicks do, which is why I can relate to a Mets fan, because they, they, they always get almost there, mm-hmm. and then it's just like, yeah. like destruction. You know what I'm saying? So, 20 me. people get hurt. It's me. Yeah, that's like, true. Yeah. But they, were on, they weren't almost anywhere. <laughs> they have a lot of injuries. It's kind of sad. I, I talk this shit only because. Um, I don't know if you guys are familiar. There's a team that plays in the Bronx. It's yes. A, it's a local, uh, as the uh, Latinos say, baseball yeah. team. Um, uh, oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Who has the best record in baseball? Okay. The Nationals appear to... Oh, shit. Uh, 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 bah, 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 uh, uh, bah, uh, I forgot. I forgot. They, that, yeah, they play every you day. You know what? That, was, that <laughs> is a perfect example of a Yankee fan. <laughs> Because <laughs> he went with his ball. He didn't go. He, he don't need research. I heard it like two days ago, and I forgot that baseball plays every single fucking six every times day. a day. I was so tight. He's playing triple headers every night. I was looking for. I was looking for the, the Yankees game, and they was like, "Dog, this is the one. This is the one, one day, day of the whole summer they don't play. <laughs> can play like a triple hitter tomorrow. Go watch some hockey. But yes, the Yankees are out there cooking, cooking, waking. Your you know man saying? comes back tonight. Yes, uh, Papi Shampoo, yes, Gary Sanchez, Sanchez El Gatti. You know what I'm saying? He's in the building. Your man Aaron Judge is out here. Out there. Woo. Devastating. Dandolenia, as we say. The judge. Shout out to my man. He's adopted. Judge and jury. Yeah, his parents hit the fucking lotto. They hit the lotto. I'm oh claiming them for Jamaica. Oh, my God. I'm claiming them for Jamaica. You didn't put your hand down fast enough. Damn. Damn. It's like, oh, no. You didn't claim it for your people. He's Jamaican now. He's Jamaican. Aaron Bumbaclaw judge. Aaron Now it's going to be wild problematic. The Yankees. Aaron. Every time he comes up, white people put on fake dreads. They yeah. put on, like, Bob Marley and Jamaican. Which happened? Which happened? Now I'm coming to the... <laughs> Bad. Aaron, we're jamming. We want to jam it with George. We don't jam it, jam it, jam it with Judge. He's gonna have like a, a show on SNY, like jamming with Judge. Oh. Hi, I'm Michael K. <laughs> have I told you I've never had a uh, curry go? Oh, you've never had curry go? That's amazing. I uh, I love Christ and everything is possible through him. I've, I've, he's the wild Bible dude too. I just I, I realize that. That's good. I, I like when my players of my church stuff. You know I know. Cause I, I'm not gonna get in trouble. How sick would you be? We go to a Yankee game, we come out, we go across the street to the dugout, and fucking uh, Aaron Judge is lining up, throwing him back shots. <laughs> <laughs> like, yo, yeah, yo, yeah. old oh, Bodega boy, shots on me, shots on me, bro. Imagine like, he was like Gronk, <laughs> <laughs> fucking the Yankees, Gronk. Nice, nice, bro. Check this one out. Nigga points to outfield, <laughs> crushed it, crushed it. <laughs> so he pours fucking Patron on the bar that sets it on fire. And like, <laughs> yeah. Sweet, oh, I can feel the burn. That was Jason Giambi. That yo, was, he was, he was, he, he was, was our grunk. No, no, he was one Staten Island grunk. You can't be good. Yo, at Italians baseball. loved him. B. Oh, who oh did? my god, the Jambino. The Jambino? He was a terrible oh, first god. baseman, and they loved him. They like, he was loved getting standing ovations and shit. <laughs> he clearly was on steroids. Yo, allegedly. it was so, yeah. The nigga looked like Johnny Bravo. Allegedly, allegedly. <laughs> allegedly. Shout out to legal. Shout out to legal. <laughs> that taught us that Putting term. Putting this on. <laughs> Nigga came to the, uh, coming to the plate, a nigga who skips leg day every day. The Jambino. 
<laughs> Those were the sad Yankee days because it'd be like, bases loaded. <laughs> bottom of the ninth. Here comes Jason Giambi. Like, yeah, this nigga got it. Yeah, yeah. he's going to swat it, bro. 2-1. Foul tips. Oh. Foul tip. Stays alive. Oh, he got this. He got this. Ooh, ooh. Oh, oh, oh. Gets a piece of it. Stays oh, alive. Oh, damn. Uh, he steps damn, out the man. box. He got it, got it, got it. Uh, I'm putting my rally cap on. Okay. He got it, got it, got it, got it. Got he's got like it. out the box. Yeah. With the yeah. bat, knocking the dirt <laughs> out his cleats. I'm like, ah, oh, I'm standing yeah. here. Yeah. Then he steps into the box and fucking whiffs. They got oh. everybody go home. Oh. <laughs> man, ooh. anticlimactic. Yes, if the Yankees lose. And you hear like that fucking New York, New York is like shuffling out the stadium. Yeah. And all the white people go to the side of the train that goes back into the city. Yes. And all the brown people on the side of the train that yes. further up. Niggas get on that blue line. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and all the normal American, all the normal Bronx residents are on the four train annoyed as fuck because like, they're like, like yo, I'm trying to do my regular job. What are these white people going on? Oh my god, yo, why is this nigga throwing up? Does this thing have a tote bag? <laughs> <laughs> like, all my belongings are in this Pathmark bag. <laughs> yo, shout out to Fenway. Sh- oh, Sweet yeah. Caroline, Caroline fuck niggers. Yeah. <laughs> Just uh, exposing it. Uh, yo, yeah. your man Kurt Schiller was like, Nobody you nobody called Adam Jones the N word. Did you not? It. It's fake news. He said if someone used the N word, other people in Fenway would have beat them up, which is true because they would have beat them up because they were not the per- they were the first person the that like to use the N word. I you beat me to it. This is my section, you fucking asshole. Hey, 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 Scully O'Toole over here, hey. 1998 champion, the nigger knocking. That's right. Okay, I'm the number one guy that says nigger over here, pal. Okay, all I right? bought the Kendrick Lamar album yeah. just for we gonna be I. Right. That's right. Okay, I can't wait to sing it. Concert can't wait. Use a hard R. All the R's. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that way wild race is like duh. Like if you ever like we're Yankee fans, so we know about this. We you know. know what I'm saying? Like whenever they whenever they dare to venture into Yankee Stadium, they're wild dickheads. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And vice versa. You yeah. know what I'm saying? You got to rep your set when you're in enemy territory. What was wild was all the Boston people like not all the Boston races, not, not all of us. No, but like no. fam, yes, come on. Yes, there are no utopias. Everywhere's yeah. racist. Everywhere's. And also, like, people always say, like, yo, New York is mad dirty and it stinks and blah, blah. And I'm like, all right, it all does. Right, you yeah. take it. You got it. Yeah, you got it. Listen. Yo, summertime, it rains. It smells like shit in Bahamas. I'm as sorry. As they said in the Bible, you take the good, you take the bad. Yeah, you take them off and then you have. The facts of life. That's right. The facts of life. Corinthians 12, whatever, something. Yeah, and, it was and, in there. And Mrs. Garrett said unto Tootie. <laughs> shout out to Tootie. Have you seen her lately? Kim Fields is her actual name. Yeah. And she had the massive sweater puppies. Yo. As a younger early, lady. Early. She actually had to get a breast reduction. That was my, that, like, yo, not for nothing. As a kid, I, watching that show, I used to be like, yo. Yeah. Yeah. Because there wasn't that many black chicks on TV. Yeah. And I was like, and I was like, I was yo, like yo. Yeah, she's I was like, bad. Yo, she, uh, I was like, yo, is she bad, bad by default? Because she's like the only black girl on yes. the show? Or like. She was she was like <laughs> Office Bay. Yeah. Think about it. Like, the black girl is always the hottest girl yeah. to us. Like, was Lisa really, was Lisa a bag like that on Stay by the Bell? Not really, but she was a black girl. In my so. mind? Because I, I was about to be oh, like, yo, you're right. But then I just thought about it. And the picture of her in my mind, She's the baddest. Yeah, but it was See? like, yo, she's like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like I would have put a toe to toe with Kelly early, early, early. What? Early. I'll take a bite. She never had, she had the yeeks. Kelly she didn't have the yeeks. You know what I'm saying? Kelly had no yeeks. And Screech, Screech was early Chris, in the game. Like, you yo, know, I'm know. with the chocolate. Come on. When I'm not masturbating with <laughs> yeah, this robot, yeah. you know, Kelly, you, was Screech Jewish? Uh, like in the, on the show. Or did he just have the wild Jufro? He just had wild Jufro. I don't think they dealt with religion. <laughs> religion shit. Their the characters about- weren't that developed. <laughs> they dealt with drug use and shit. No religion shit. Oh, uh, shit. If that was a real, if that was like real life, uh, Kelly would have definitely ended up pregnant. Oh, for sure. She Kev, so Zach would have got her pregnant. Like, not Zach, but like that older dude. Remember, like, there was like a 40 year old. I feel like. Oh, he, the dude from the Max? Yeah. The older, like, yeah. Like 40 years, like, yeah. Her pipe or some shit. Yep. Damn, he would have definitely knocked her up. Zach would have thought it was his baby. Mm-hmm. He would have dropped out of school, yeah. started working at Jimmy John's. So it would have been a mess, become the wild alt right person, yep. blaming yep. brown people for his problems and shit. Yep. A Slater, nigga Slater, Slater would have been successful. About immigration, you, you wasn't born here. Yo, Slater. get the fuck out of my country. Get here. Nigga's like, yo, I'm just trying to host extra and chill. Get out of here. <laughs> Yo, Sam. See, the fucking uh, gets Jim Crow at the max and shit. Lisa can't sit at the table. Man, Lisa can't sit at the table. Lisa can't sit at the table. Lisa with her and shit. He's like, fucking race trainer. Get out of here. Fucking asshole. Just put a milkshake on top of her. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. Yo. The max used to be a good place. Yo. For good, hardworking, honest Americans. That's right. They take all the hip hop out the jukebox. Heritage, not hate. Uh, <laughs> the heritage, not hate burger. Keep Bayside pure. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Bayside Tigers, the White Tigers, the White Tigers, gonna stay white. Yeah, bum, no bum, black bum, stripes. Bum. Go wait, Bayside. <laughs> Thirteen letters. Yo. That Yo. got dark fast. Damn, no, stop. 
Oh man. Shut the bayside being Shut wild. The bayside. I mean, was that that as diverse? For for the time, I don't feel like it was, really wasn't. There was I mean, one. It was wasn't one that diverse. Again, they weren't really in school. And what was Slater? Was Slater Latino? Like what? Like he was like Hawaiian, or something. right? Because he all oh, like Samo- yeah, yeah, I remember. Yeah, yeah, they had the episode where he was like doing the yeah. Dance his father shit. was always like transferring around and shit. Yeah, and yeah. Father was like a military colonel and shit. You know what I'm saying? Well, the good reason. thing about Say by the Bell is it's iconic. And one day, some stupid uh, private white institution, some liberal arts college, is going to teach a course on it. Oh, you already know. And some kids are going to take it and be like, oh, oh, I can't get a job because I have my master's in like Say by, by the Bell. Bell. <laughs> Say by the Bell <laughs> history. Here's critical <laughs> intersectional feminist discourse <laughs> propagated through Jesse Spano. <laughs> like what? I'm like, wow, you're not getting the job. Nigga, is, do you got a degree this? saved by the bell from Sarah Lawrence, nigga? <laughs> yeah. Get the fuck out of here. Throw your fucking, just throw your resume in the air like Bobby Schmurda had, nigga. Like, fuck out of here. Nigga, <laughs> <laughs> you gonna print out your resume just to talk to the garbage. Like, yo. You. <laughs> like, you send it over my PDF? I'll be right back. I'll be right back. You just get mad. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, matter of yeah. fact, I printed out five copies of your resume for everyone on this floor. <laughs> <laughs> we synchronized throwing this shit in the garbage. Yeah, watch. walk through the parking lot, niggas, like the Canyon Heroes. Hey, look, we're going to do the mannequin chapter with your resume. <laughs> <laughs> ah, right from the garbage. <laughs> niggas is wild disrespectful. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Niggas are shaking with the paper. Is this your, act- this is your phone number? This is your real phone number right now? All right. Oh, niggas okay. call your phone. Your phone to you? Like, yo. Yo. You ain't got the job. Ah! Stupid! You're like, like yo, I'm, I'm right, right here, dog. Funny. That was that was that wasn't cool. Oh man, I stored you in my number as boss because like, I thought possibly. like, all right, let me call back. I'm like, yo, we ain't even at Red Bull. What, is, what are you doing? What, what I, 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 the yeah. I really need that. my rent to do. Oh man, oh man, yo, uh, Canelo Chavez. Is that Chavez what we're going to Chavez Jr. Chavez. Yeah, mm. <laughs> imagine Travis in the sixty years old, throwing, putting up his dukes. I got Canelo. Be, we got front row seats. I, that's what I think we do. I hope so. That'd be lit. Cause I'm pulling up in like a t-shirt and a snap. Like, yo, I want to get, I want to get the wild. Uh, I want to get like blood on me. I want him to like <laughs> yo, I want blood him to on lose, Daddy. I want him to lose his mind. Just beat him, and like the ref is like, stop, stop. He's dead. He's just like beating like chunks, in, like, like <laughs> fucking chunks of blood and like falling <laughs> in the front row and shit. Like Gallag- like a fucking Gallagher. Yeah, I'm like, Whoa! yeah. Whoa! Let's go, Rangers. Oh, wow. What happened? Yo, Honey Boo Boo's mother is 37? Stop it. Wow. Nigga, Look that's her now. fucking blood alcohol level. Yo, Yo, what? That's her now? Yeah, she got, she lost mad weight. And Suddenly shit. we lost another bit. What? Mm hmm. Yo! What Maybe the she f- done something with the skin on her arms too? Like yeah, no, she, the body she there was for some show about losing weight and stuff, and like she did mass surgeries and stuff. She went to DR. There was like the el diablo, me and that guy, that nigga got the big ass needle and shit. Like yo, papi, try me to. Like turned out the rabbit shot up. She got the razor. Like Tony is going to be a long uh, night. Oh shit! Yeah, mami, did you go to aventura? Nigga puts on the fucking Romeo Santos and shit. Like took the wild shot of rum. Like. Uh, like a it was a gonyo. <laughs> hey, yeah. bro, Philippe, Philippe, hey, bring the truck, bring the truck. They got the pickup truck on the back, and they're riding on the side of it, like yeah. oh, man, bumps and shit, holding it down, like yo. <laughs> Yeah. Come on, come on, yeah. Wow, what do they do with all that fat? They make soap out of it. Uh, they sell it to sausage makers in Williamsburg. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, there's got to be a good use for human fat. Good use for human fat. You can make like that sounds like a disgusting thing. No, we're gonna make a pop up store. I'm telling you this because like uh, we were talking to Spike Jones. Yeah, I was like, yo, we gotta. We're already like successful. We're at the point now. We gotta start doing weirdo art shit. Yeah. So I wanna start. I wanna do a three month. No, one month uh-huh. or maybe just one weekend pop up shop. Yeah. In Williamsburg, no license. We just take over like one of the abandoned storefronts. Right. And we're either gonna sell like just what's gonna be called like skin, and we're just gonna sell like products made from human skin. Oh and shit. Fat like candles. Nice. And soap. Yeah. Uh, notebooks and the cover is made from the skin of our enemies. Ah! Uh, that's hot, that's lit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Placenta chipotle. Oh, <laughs> Placenta no! yogurts no! with the flipping cups. Oh no! <laughs> with little almonds on the side. Oh god! <laughs> get all get all your protein for the day. Things coming on some bad cannibal shit. I want to see the asshole actually sits down and eats that. If you walk in that store and you smell something delicious cooking, you just walk out. Yeah. Uh, uh, I just come with a tray. I'll be like, samples? This is like a nigga's nose on the shit. Like, here. They're like, uh, like, here. Like, They're like, what is this? I said, would you like a sample? Would you like an ear d'oeuvre? Yeah. <laughs> 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 people there like, yeah. <laughs> 
Uh-oh. No. The hottest restaurant in Williamsburg is Skin. <laughs> oh my God. Rihanna and Nick Cannon were seen leaving Skin at oh, 1 a.m. Spicy. Oh. It was, I, I heard they had the pita chips oh. in the ears. It was wild. <laughs> The newest hot couple, Jesse Williams and Anna Wintour. <laughs> Yo, shout out to Jesse Williams. Oh, Jesse Williams, we chill with him. You know what I'm saying? Homie. Oh, we did Open Run, which open is run, dropping check that out. Dropping today. Too. Oh, so you, you know, know he's going to double dip today. Shout yeah. out to you. You guys, you, you know what I'm saying? We can all, there's enough art for everybody. Come on. I don't understand why people who aren't, I mean, I get it. Yeah. I'm not going to complain. Yeah, yeah. Because I was about to say, like, why aren't you guys satisfied with it? But that's sad, because, you know, if they, it's like a relationship. If you... At least I'm not taking us for granted yet. Yeah. Because it's going to get warm. It's, it's almost taking people for granted weather. That is. You know is, what I'm saying? It is. Don't we become complacent. We have different rules because, you know, we're busy. It's like we're not answering the text because I'm busy. You know busy I'm busy. I'm working. Be you know working, man. I just, a guy on my Instagram, every day, like, he's giving, like, business advice. He's like, you got to want it. You got to get up, grind, da 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 You know what I'm saying? If you're yeah. around people that's not successful, you're not going to be successful. And, like, my nigga, how are you recording? Motivational videos at 10 a.m. in the back of a SUV uh, every day. Like, don't you have a job? Yeah. What do you? Also, who who gave you? Are you an Uber driver? To do this shit. Because <laughs> <laughs> I like chain. It says like Mr. Big Money. I'm like, yo. Nah. See, if that's... you really was Big Money, you wouldn't have to no, advertise exactly. the chain. Exactly. Like white people that have Big Money, they don't have chains. that say Mr. Big Money. They don't even know. They don't even know the difference between a 4.0 and a 4.6. You know what I'm you saying? Know what I'm saying? <laughs> Bill Gates never wakes up like, honey, Melinda. Have you seen my big money chain? <laughs> <laughs> Melinda, I think I'm going to go with the iced out Windows logo just to, just to stun on these fuck boys. Fuck out of here. Nigga wakes up in the morning, throws on his fucking lens crafted glasses, his fucking beat up Air Monarchs, <laughs> and goes and just watches the computer say, you have mad money, nigga, you have mad money, nigga, you have mad money. I have to go to Facebook headquarters. Give me my iced out surface. <laughs> I'll show this fuck boy. <laughs> Yo, uh, is Facebook? Uh, did, did I read that right correctly? Facebook is trying to stop curb fake news. They're trying to curb fake news. <laughs> fake news basically took off because of Facebook. Because of Facebook, and so now, now you feel bad. No, you know, uh, that's I like you give him shorty herpes and then you get head of medication. Like, my, I, I should have just not gave you herpes in the first place. I'm sorry. Okay, I don't. I'm. I'm not. I haven't had that episode <laughs> in the Jesus nice what? TV think show happen yet. It sounds like. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just turn to the after school special. So I listened to this. It's like, coño, <laughs> dirty dick mirror. <laughs> but uh, yeah. yeah, no, he's gonna run for office, mm. and I don't understand why no one is disturbed by this. Facebook is the easiest way to reach stupid people. Oh my god! And if the owner of Facebook wants mm. to run for office, like he's just gonna be like, uh, fam, whoever he's running against, he'd be like, yo, they suck wild donkey dick, and people gonna be like, yo, <laughs> absolutely. You, you heard uh, Chelsea Clinton? Yeah, she He'll, went to Mexico, had a train run out of her right. by some burros. That's right. They're yeah. gonna show a, a picture of a fucked up baby in a NICU. Like this is Chelsea Clinton's secret baby. Mm-hmm. Vote mm-hmm. for her. You're voting yeah. ten likes. It means she, she's voting for her. Did you know her and Chris Brown get drunk and smack women? And you'd be like, what? That, <laughs> that's you, not real. Your aunt's gonna be like, it's true. It's I true. Saw it on I saw Facebook. It. it had a gif. It was. It was real. Yeah, it said breaking. Uh huh. Okay, and it came I, from. I can't vote for her. Yeah, she's just she's just as bad as Trump. Yeah, it came from Cool News Source dot io dot io x dot ru. Yeah, so it's real. Mm. <laughs> I saw it on Damn. The CNN dot breaking news dot I'm like, what? <laughs> what is he trying to run for? Like president or president, president of the United president. States? Oh, so he's it's just about he like the president of the universe. That's what I'm saying. Like you could, he could get voted president of the fucking anything. And they could make up some shit. Yeah, I'm president of Pangea. Like fucking, <laughs> yeah. Uh, and niggas will vote for him because Facebook is full of morons. Well, you can't stop rich people. Once upon a time, I used to believe that the world was fair. People cared about each other and all this stuff, and there was checks and balances. Nope. Nah. You just got to get as rich as you fucking yeah, can and dog. step on everyone on your way. Dog. Because no one gives a fuck about anything anymore. That's real. Look at that. Trump very... doesn't care. None of these rich people care about shit. They just took mad people <laughs> off of health care, but they all got their health care. So they're chilling. Like, they don't give a fuck. Are you crazy? It's like they're fucking America. They got their nut, and they're like, yo, mom, I'm out. Uh, yo, I'm out. Yo. <laughs> you, better rub, yo, you better rub that clit yourself. And we over here like, yo, could you get an Uber at least? Like, like uh, no. I'm just like, yo, fam, you're not even going to top me. Like, can I get it? She's like, nah, I gotta go. I gotta get up early in the morning. Sorry, bye. Sorry. Good job. <laughs> just hit the fucking door slam. I'm like, yo, what the fuck? Yo. I can't even get a rag. Oh, uh, no. Get the wild, like, cum spot. Like, yo. <laughs> yo, please. Uh, you gonna leave fuck? me here? The she gets fuck? dry and fucking sticky I'm and disgusting. Like, you get in the shower. Can't, can't roll over in bed and oh, shit. You're like, yo, man. come on. Yo, nothing in the shower. Top five worst things. Because it's like, as soon as that nut hits any skin surface mm-hmm. and the water hits it, mm-hmm. it turns into, like, fucking... You know, yeah. all my shower smashes up. Like, if the shit hits, it turns into like a weird 
the chemical composition of the shit changes and it turns into like glue. Mm-hmm. And then getting that shit off, you gotta be in there like, mm-hmm. with the wild loofah, mm-hmm. nigga. And then your loofah's full of cum. Mm-hmm. If you two experience <laughs> weird shower cum ejaculations, please check with your primary physician. Call us up. What should it be happening? one 800 2 3 9 7 9 7 like, When cum hits water, your... it changes. Oh shit, the Red Bull car just drove by. Wop, wop. Uh, <laughs> Cum does not change when it hits water. Yeah. No, it does not. When you're in the shower, jerk off in the shower or have sex in the shower. I have. And ejaculate full, like, into the shower. Don't nut in shorty or, like, pull out and, like, nut it. Let the water mingle with the nut and it will turn into something. It turns it completely different. I think you're confusing gremlins with uh, <laughs> cum. I mean, they both serve the same purpose. You know what I'm saying? Like <laughs> Both don't get them wet after midnight and shit. <laughs> Uh, shut the gremlins! Wow, shut the gremlins! I haven't seen let's a movie remake that gremlins. Long. We should we remake gremlins, but instead of the gremlins, we make um uh, Mexicans that are taking our jobs. Mexicans, 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 Mexicans. We're just making movies for the alt right. Yeah, that's it. We're just go, we're playing up the people with economic anxiety. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're making movies and shit for Trump for them supporters. Because yeah. yo, low key, I didn't even realize this. Like all those like Christian Bible movies mm-hmm. make mad money on the low. So much fucking money. I was like, oh shit, wait a minute. Maybe mm-hmm. we should just get on some like. Uh, uh, bullshit like yo, yo, we're Christian now. Yo, exactly. Economics, the Bible boys. The Bible boys in the building. Yo, it's your yo. boy, young Nebuchadnezzar. Yeah, 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 that's right. It's Mero Miraculous. <laughs> hey, <laughs> oh, it's coming to you from St. Patrick's Cathedral. That's right, home of the Messiah, y'all. Bless him up, bless up, bless yeah. up. All things are done through his name. Hey, big up, big up. Hope you're having a blessed weekend. Yeah, that's right, Pastor Mero. Oh, I, I, I am. It's amazing. It's amazing. Just the other day, I saw something that reminded me. What did you? Of John 7 18. Oh, wow. And the passage reads, uh, niggas ain't shit but dough and dick. And that made me realize this when I was talking to my homegirl in the supermarket. And she said that to me. And I said, you know what? Be blessed, my sister. Praise him, praise him. Praise him. Praise him. And and and, and I just want to say to, to to the to the to the people, uh, we appreciate y'all and, Testify. and and thank y'all for, for strengthening the brand mm-hmm. and, and through Christ. Hallelujah. Uh, through through which all things are possible. All things are possible. Uh, Pastor Jesus, I, I want you to share a story that you shared with me uh, <laughs> back at, in in the pew, and, and I, I was mean, just really enlightened and and I and, mean, and happy. Can, can I share a story, Please. or am I just a vessel for His work? That's that, that is <laughs> true. Mean, that is true. Praise Him. Praise Him. Pra- praise Him. All uh, praises. The other day, all praises. I was at my low point. Yeah. Okay. I was. I was. I had one blunt left. Oh my goodness. Oh. Okay. How, I knew how did I wouldn't have a rap for the morning. How did, did you pray on Trials it? and tribulations. Oh, my I goodness. tossed and turned in that bed all night, my brother. I praise, tell you I praise. did. I tell you I did. But praise. when I woke up. What? When I woke up. When you woke up. For the blood of Jesus. Yes, Lord. I looked. Yes, Lord. And where was it? Underneath my Bible. Oh. Yet another blunt rap. Yes. Cherry flavor. God is good. Like the love praise of my father. Him. Praise, praise him. him. Praise him. Praise him. Praise him. Because my God is no bitch nigga. No, no, no. My God is a real nigga. He's a real nigga. We got to church niggas. for real niggas. This is mad niggas. It's him. Real nigga church. Real nigga church. Real nigga church. Real nigga church. Just bust a shot. Burn up. Niggas putting scam credit cards and fire sticks and shit in the collection. But I'm like, yo. Once again, stop putting Fox Leafs in the collection. Yo. I know who's doing it. Yo. Listen, if y'all gonna put Bud as y'all tithe, y'all need to vacuum seal it. Mm-hmm. The police have dogs that smell it. You got the sanctuary smelling like the Pacquiao. Come, Come on. on, y'all. That's where we pray. Let's 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 have some discretion, okay. y'all. Thank so, you. All right. Be now blessed. We got, we got Reverend Tackstone. He's uh, <laughs> with the prison ministry. He's skyping in right now. Hey, what's good, beloved? Listen, I want all my niggas to bow y'all heads right now at this moment. Bow your heads right now for the ramen noodles which I have prepared just now that I want to bless up to the Lord. Bless up. Uh, I want to just thank God and that I'm blessed and I'm locked down right now mm-hmm. and I'll be home soon, but my waves are still spinning. The hairline is on struggle, but the waves are still spinning. Bless up. Be blessed, everybody in the parish. You know what I'm saying? I'm here for y'all. Holla at your boy. You know what I'm saying? That new few design is dropping soon. It's about to be late. Okay, no promo. No, Holla. only oh, promo oh, for the Lord. My fault, my fault, my fault, okay. my fault. St- all right, stay blessed, beloved. There we go. Holla. Listen, we're going to get all that all right. <laughs> we're going to have it on the wall and land on preacher suits. <laughs> I can't wait. Can't wait. Is it, I don't feel like there's a. What's the big Spanish mega church for Dominicans? We have like a big. There's that shit that comes on. There's that shit that comes on like. Yeah, there's that shit that comes. There's shit that comes on like on the weekends. Yeah. And it's like mail order church shit. Like you could order like 
Jesus water and shit like that. And those niggas make bread. Yeah. Yeah. Cause they're like, yo, we're gonna send you a blessed candle or like a blessed rack or some shit. And it should be $35 or some shit like that. And niggas really buy the shit. And it's a fucking rock. Yeah. So shout out to all my niggas out there hustling. Getting that Jesus rock. And they got a dude that looks like a wild fake Jesus with a fake beard. And Mm -hmm. he's like blessing the crib and shit. It's wild. We gotta do that. We gotta do one of those things where like people walk through the street and they beat someone and like the person's really bleeding and they're carrying the cross. Oh, yeah. yeah. do that. But I. Shame. Shit, Shame, yeah. but we're Shame. gonna do it with you. You're gonna be like carrying the cross, but yeah. like we're gonna be doing jokes and shit. Yeah, oh, it's lit. Yeah, it's be like, oh, yeah, yeah. And I'm gonna be eating chicharrones instead of getting whipped. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And we're gonna fight. Like you're gonna have like a handle holding the cross. Yeah, yeah. Like, he's not really carrying. He's it. not really carrying it. What the fuck is just wheels fake. on that, nigga? This is, that's a North Face book bag. Is he on a hoverboard? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Fuck it, we out here. He has no foundation. <laughs> <laughs> that's yeah, that's, that's right. We're getting sexy. I'm going to find out what my shade is when we get to Vegas. Oh, nice. <laughs> my catch is spray tan. <laughs> yeah, we're going to come. Oh. We're gonna, I'm not going to come through looking like A Rod, nigga. Right, yeah, this is sexy. <laughs> He's going to have highlights in his beard. Yo, I, I don't know how. A, I'm a cop uh, blue contacts. You got to get a Jerry Curl. They're going to be like, yo, is that A Rod and Pedro Martinez? I'm like, yeah, <laughs> I gotta. I want to look wild, hickish to the point where they have to check my bag for cocaine when I'm coming back. Like, yo, chill, chill, chill. Secondary, I don't know. Secondary street. Yeah, it's like you got the loafers with no socks. I don't I'm know. like, you're just doing this because you're, I'm a black man with natural blue eyes. Blink, blink, blink. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, and eyelash extensions. <laughs> I'm coming back so zestful with Yo. the fucking Ed Hardy. I'm going to look like Guy Fieri. Have so you ever been to Vegas? I've never been. I've never been to Vegas either. I've never been. I oh, feel shit. Vegas Virgin. Vegas Virgin. And yeah. then we're going with like a super rich motherfucker. Yo. So we could die. Well, you, I don't want to say who. I don't want niggas to run up. Yeah, yeah, no, don't run up. Because I feel like at home he might have his own AK. He's he might. Go pull out the fucking gold oh. AK to start busting. Yo, what if we hop off the plane and he's like, yo, my nigga here, boom, he gives you a case, he gives me a case, and you pop it open, and it's the wild El Chapo gun nigga with our names engraved in the handle and shit? You said what if? Yeah. <laughs> Do. Yo, it's like chop, catch a chop. body and just dump money on it. Like, yo, someone bury this, yo, it's, yo, bury yo, this piece of shit. Yeah, clean this up. Like, uh, to the valet, like, yo, I'm plug like, my car and clean this fucking scumbag. Like, you can't <laughs> just shoot niggas. She turns into that the fucking last day. For, was that? Did not pocket shot of the Bellagio? Or outside the Bellagio? No, it was a. Uh, it, it was some S- other hotel. Some other hotel. But according to Funkmaster Flex, yo, did you see that? Yo, yo that nigga was in pure tears talking about. T- I was like, yo, look, okay. You have a closer knowledge of dude because he's from like Ina Wall area or whatever. But like, I, we've both been listening to this guy forever. Like, we're New York kids, grew up in the 90s listening to Flex. Mm-hmm. Know about Flex when he was playing house. So it's like we watched this dude's like career. Yeah, yeah. Is he just like me- like mentally whacked right now? Or is he just trying to be still re, re- relevant? Because I'm like, yo, this thing is crying right now. Like, all, uh, he's crying on Instagram Live about Tupac and, like, sh- taking shots at T.I. and shit. And I'm just like, bro, I'm watching the shit like, it's perplexing. W- what is going on here? It's weird you because, you know, you grow up and you see these people and, like, you're just like, what is, uh, what's the end game here? Yeah. Like, that's the problem with Instagram Live. You could destroy your legacy because you worked mad years. Mad years to build. For, like, two nights. Fam. Because you just want to wild out, take a faithful of Yayo and just start telling rap stories wild and shit. Like, Yo, I remember seeing a uh, fucking uh, Flex at a at a bodega on Middletown Road right off the 6. Uh-huh. And I was like, damn, this nigga's mad cool. Like, as a little kid, like, being like, yo, this is the nigga that plays all the cool music on, on you know what I mean, on the radio. Like, he's, he's, he's breaking records and shit. And now it's just like, damn, you're just like a wing on Instagram crying. Yeah, yeah you don't want to see that for Flex. Flex yeah. don't need to do shit like that. Uh, yeah, it's bittersweet. But I mean, I, I guess other people were show, popping up talking about don't talk about too. Like, why? Like, you someone's dead. You can't. They can't. You can't really slander them. We got rules yeah. and shit. Like, yeah. Also, <laughs> Tupac hears that shit. They're gonna be tight. <laughs> He's gonna be so mad. When that nigga, when Yo, he, I don't know what the Wi Fi's like in Cuba, but when he gets he gets finished downloading Ooh. that shit, he's like, what? He's like, he's like, what? Oh, this nigga wanna be one of my enemies. But we put down my Hennessy. <laughs> Just put this nigga in the mental penitentiary. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> he got me vexed. <laughs> Funk flex. <laughs> Funk flex I, got my mind vexed. Fatal when Hussein. I ride with my nine. <laughs> I got death on my mind. <laughs> Fact flex on my grind. Yo, shout out to Tupac. I feel like there's been mad times where we go on Tupac tangents, but like. The nigga had a lot of whack music, guys. Like, you know, he had a lot. He, he had a lot. He had very good music. Too much of his music got released. Yes, and I think a lot, a lot of music he didn't want to get released. Get released. Yep. Because that's it. Listen, if Michael Jackson didn't have people that cared about him in his circle, <sighs> there would be a lot. 
Dog. A lot of whack Michael Jackson Fam. floating around. Right, but how sad would you be right now? If there was like a whack mic cut? Uh, oh, fuck it. If we found out tomorrow, Michael Jackson recorded a reggaeton album. Uh, <laughs> that might be Flames. No. <laughs> like, like, you did it with J Balvin D, and shit? Yeah. D. Some more. <laughs> Daddy Yankee. I'm a reggaeton. Palagiala. Smoke a hookah. Is a fucking Mike remember the time video, and then Michael Jackson dancing around with I know fucking baby. Do you remember the time when I, I made you cry? Do you remember the time my from the start to the end? Me, oh my god, damn, yo, that was a dope video. That was that was an amazing video. Mike had the illest videos be like. That's when music videos were like. Uh, it wasn't just like, yo, look how opulent this video is. It was like, yo, this is a, a dope concept. And shit. Well, that's back when um, record companies would give you money for videos. For video, yeah. Now yeah. they're like, oh, you want money? <laughs> oh, okay. It will come out your 360 deal. And then you're like, what is 360 deal? <laughs> oh, I don't know what that is. <laughs> <laughs> I, got a, I got an Xbox One. <laughs> what a 360 deal. Like you better off not getting a deal than getting a 360 deal. Like, I mean, I you know what I've I, I read about like I read a lot of it, it, fucking record guys talking about amongst themselves about the shit, and it's like, G and it's like it depends on who you are. Like if you're somebody like Kendrick Lamar or something like that, you definitely do not want a fucking 360 deal. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But if you're like some wing ding SoundCloud rapper who's just fucking happy to be on, sign a 360 deal, nigga, for a year. Or two, you know what I mean? Well, like, are they? I don't think they're doing one year three sixty deals. Niggas doing ten year three sixty yeah. deals. You <laughs> are locked. signing baseball contracts. They got, you got to sign stupid people into Damn. long term deals. That's how you make your money. That's right. Niggas try to bamboozle us like that, but no, no. way. Listen, you already every, know. For every Kendrick Lamar, you yeah. got a lot of SoundCloud rappers out there, yeah. and they're like, yo, sign to. Broke Boy Records and yep. shit, and they call in their agent every day, like, yo, where's my album coming out? Yo, yo, I need more money. I spent that twenty thousand dollar advance. They're like, that nigga, that was not an advance. <laughs> All right, you owe the record company twenty thousand dollars. <laughs> He's like, what'd you spend it on? Oh, this chain that I says, this time. That says, that says record deal, record flashy, <laughs> that says flashy fly, fly boy. That was the name of my album. They was like, well, you better go sell that shit. You better go sell that shit. Matter of <laughs> fact, come to the mail room on Monday. Baby. You gonna work this shit off. <laughs> Yeah, they try to lock us yeah. in 360, dude. Fuck out of here. That would be bad. Shout out to Victor for every curl on his head has been a good finesse for <laughs> us contractually. <laughs> yeah, because if we if we had gotten into a bad deal, like our souls would have been broken, uh, we still would have working. But this podcast yeah. would be dark. Nigga, you crazy? We never would have read a Red Bull. We recorded this Bro, shit in the Bronx. Are you kidding? This should be like, yo, it's called the Fuck Y'all Niggas uh, podcast. Shit. Nigga, until... I get fed up and go on a fucking robbery spree and then you're like, yo, what is this thing about rap? I'm in the studio away for this guy and you turn on new stuff and it's like, savage Dominican males on a bodega robbing spree on Fordham Road. No, you know what it was? What happened? <laughs> everyone, because we just stopped the podcast and one day trending would be Bodega Boys because me and you are robbing every bodega <laughs> up and down I-95. Like, fuck that! On, on like Facebook Live and shit. They're like, if you own a bodega, stay inside. Stay Put inside. <laughs> if you have someone in your family named Poppy, please call them and warn them. The Bodega Boys are on the loose. <laughs> They're armed in hookah. Oh my god, why did they stop them? <laughs> why did they allow Facebook Live to be a thing? <laughs> yo. Just got a video of us like robbing niggas. Like, yo, yo, give me one fucking little Debbie's nigga. Ball stock crutch in the bag. We're not even stealing money. We're still <laughs> fucking we're stealing. They're just stealing Dutchess. <laughs> I, I, I don't get it. I don't understand. I said, why, why don't they just pay? In the last video, I clearly saw Jesus had money in his pocket. I'm like, that's the principle. It's the principle, nigga. It's the principle. Fuck out of here. Do the drop. I don't know what that means. <laughs> Do the drop is what we tell the people. We tell them, get on the floor. Do the drop. Do the drop. Niggas interview Victor. He's like, no, I know these guys for a long time. They would never in a million. Never. This is not like them. Something's going on here. What? There's something going on behind the scenes. I'm telling y'all. Bob, the most perplexing thing about the Bodega Boys robbery pattern is every time they rob a bodega, they take three to four minutes to yell out AKAs. I don't. <laughs> you're right. Directly into the surveillance camera. <laughs> like our, our water posters have mad text yeah. at the bottom. AKA Young Chipotle. AKA yeah. Jermaine Avocado Toast. Loki would be mad funny to actually do that as like a publicity stunt, but now that we blew it up on the thing. Can't do it now. But Only the true Bodega Hive will know. Only you know true. what I'm saying? So we might do that. We might go on a robbery spree. Only, you and know it what? might if be fake. It might be real. You never know. Real Bodega Hive members, if you take a candle and you put your hand over it, mm -hmm. you have to burn the skin off the palm of your hand. And when it scabs up, yeah. you peel off the scab. Yeah. And if you have like a white, thin white line, that means uh -huh. you are part of the chosen Bodega uh -huh. Hive. And you will go with us to Bodega Heaven. Nice. 
Nice. Like, I, I, I can't wait. I, I can't wait to at least two <laughs> idiots do that. And then like, we fucking the one of the wild blister shit. They're like, Davis, I'm the true one. I'm the true one. I'm the, I'm the wonderling. I'm like, nigga, that is your I'm bone? Like, you, uh, <laughs> that is I'm a metatarsal? Like, you, I was like, uh, sir, uh, I can see, uh, your, is that uh, your secondary skin layer? <laughs> yeah. Shout out to the shout out to have because they're not just brainless fans. Right. A lot of them did not drink Vienna sauce juice although we, we, we asked I them did to <laughs> you, did, did. For the you did, did for the culture you did that i respect that for the culture you did, did. for the culture you know you had to Listen, yeah, I do. You know what I'm saying? I mean, so, I, f- so, so I, I feel like it. it was I was a little smith and I just I wanted to see that on Instagram. I mean, that was me being selfish and it spiraled out of control. But hey, content for y'all on a, on a boring weekend. You know what I'm saying? The, um, the way we created that completely organic. That's that create completely organic. Come you on, got son. Ta- you got booking agencies. Come on, son. That agency Come got on. 20 niggas doing Bro, 50 proposals. That's what I'm weeks. saying. Get Come on! Top of my head, Ten decks? Like, what? Do we have a deck for this? No. One blunt. I had a blunt for this. Okay. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> they don't see the vision. Mm-mm. It's going to be me, you, mm. sitting in a room, all white, and we just sit there with blue blockers on. We can't see anything, and there's white noise in the back. That's and right. people come up to us, and they're like, <laughs> Jesus Miro, because by then we've become a singularity. Yeah. That's so, like, yeah. um, Niggas like Siamese twins are showing. We yeah. no longer eat. Or no. take shits. We just survive off no. weed smoke. Yes. We're like Professor X and Logan. We, we do a photosynthesis now at this point. Is your weed? Like, and they come and they we're like, we need a pitch for uh, both speakers. We're like, mm. they sound good. <laughs> Bows. Get shows. That's, that's brilliant. That's what brilliant. we do. And then, like security comes and ushers him away. Like take him away, take him away, take him away, take him away. And like, then we just collapse. Like they got rushed over with a butt. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Why are you letting them take so many clients in one day? I tell you, the power of weakness. They're and exhausting. They got a carry mirror to like the bed. He's like, oh. spazzing out and shit. Uh, uh, they come to me you. with the wild warm Bex. Like please, drink up, please, drink up. This shit just dribbling in your face. Like oh, 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 just like Mugatu and shit. Like. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's going to have tragic occurrences. You're destroying them. You're no, destroying them. They can, they can no longer control us. We're just having like fucking attacks in the middle of the day of just content. We're just like. <laughs> the niggas just like hyper evolve and we start talking like the aliens from Arrival <laughs> through weed smoke and shit. Like, <laughs> I can see everything. Victor's the only one that can translate. He's like, oh. He's like you don't understand. It's very nuanced. Like, I've, I've never seen this before. These aren't vape tricks. They're creating slogans for things that don't exist yet. <laughs> yeah. I'm sitting there, I'm like, best Trump death camp on the Eastern Seaboard. Everyone's like, what? 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 What, 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 is what? That, what does that mean? It's just like my eyes just start flashing mad red. It's just like, oh my god! In front of the building, like free, free Demiro, free Demiro. <laughs> Give them their agency. They're people. Yeah. But they're not precogs. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Um, yeah, man, shout out to fucking society. Society. <laughs> that's why we gotta get rich so we don't be part of society. Word. So that's why when stuff that affects regular people, that we we're just like, what happened, dog? I saw I'm the like, fr- wait. Uh, uh, how many people lost health care? What is that? What's health care? So why don't the rest of y'all just? So wait, you can't just pay your doctor's cash? You don't do that? The doctor doesn't oh. come to your house? Wait, y'all niggas don't got sag? What? Oh, 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 okay. oh, oh, my bad. Damn. That's wild. I Damn. mean, I got a doctor in Calabasas. So if you, oh, you just, oh, you're not trying to get titties. You're trying to get, oh, you have SARS. Oh, you have, uh, your kidney doesn't work. Oh. oh, oh. I don't know anybody that does that. So oh. what happens now? Like, do you. You just buy a new one, right? No. You buy a new one? You could die? I, I had no idea. I had no idea. That doesn't sound right. Damn, we have to loop. Yeah, I don't know. We, we're late to Spike Jones's house. Yeah, so I'll see you later. I'll talk, uh, uh, email uh, me? Yeah, hello. Nah, man. I don't even answer emails anymore. Yeah, don't worry about it. Nah. Just don't die. Just, you know what I'm saying? Stay alive. Yeah, something. yeah. Because yeah. we have a movie coming out, so you want to oh, see that. you know what? Uh, go to Aeron. Get the deer antler shot. I heard it's great for everything. Yeah. Yeah, go do that. Yeah. yeah. All right, buck up, champ. All right, take it easy. Nigga's <laughs> 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 like, <laughs> 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 coughing up blood. like, please. He's like, no, please, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I need $30. They're going to take away my house. I'll be like, if I give you $30, you'll never learn to appreciate money. So. Yeah. I just come in mad smack like that's right. But my brother says it's true. If you teach a man to fish, he's only gonna eat tuna sandwich. There you go. You know what I'm saying? My new thing. They're is- like, bro, how many Xanax are you on? I'm like, yes. All of them. <laughs> my new thing is I'm gonna walk around with cans of Vienna sausages and autograph them and chuck them at and people. Chuck them at people. 
<laughs> just like a crowd. I'm like, oh, who's Jesus fan? Like, oh, yeah. like the t-shirt shit. <laughs> That's that. Yeah, we gotta start doing that. Um, my, my thing is gonna be a condom with a hole in it. <laughs> a, con- a condom that says, "Do not use this." <laughs> <laughs> with a smiley face. Like, Yo. <laughs> you gotta press it against your chest to sign it. Like. <laughs> They're like, is this used? Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, my own fucking. Uh, they go back. It can't be used because these Mero doesn't use condoms. Yeah, like, that's not Mero's. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Nasty. gonna come back with placebo Plan B pills. Oh, <laughs> 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 <Like, "Yo." laughs> uh, so yeah. gross. Yeah, we're terrible. But hey, you love us. We need to make. This a, is what you guys get. This is what you get. You know what I'm saying? Because the other stuff we have to appease. S and P. S and P. FCC. OPP advertisers, you know, what I'm you know what I'm saying? But here, here, do what we the fuck. Now we do what we want. Now we do it. Do whatever the fuck we want. You know Actually, saying? it's just because we're flying under the radar. One day, some people are gonna find out about this and gonna be like, "What? What? They're gonna be like, the, fuck? the fuck has this been going on for this long?" <laughs> they were like, "So wait, y'all heard this podcast before y'all gave them a show?" Uh, I can't. I, want, I can't wait. They're gonna be like discussing us. They're gonna be like. Hashtag boycott bodega boys. Another <laughs> advertiser dropped out. We're here with Megan Kelly. Like she's like, it was just a great. Like they hate white people. They hate them so much. They hate. Um, uh, just it's triggering the sound that Miro I mean, makes when he pulls the butt cheeks apart. And I mean, it's just like cuckold fest. I, what is that? What I mean, is, it's just. It's, 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 it's frankly, they should not have a show. And uh, it's irresponsible and reprehensible that Vice Land would even give these people a platform. I mean. I would love to speak to Meryl's wife. I mean, like, he's so abusive of white women. I, I, I can only imagine their home life. I mean... Uh. Tommy, do you have anything to say? Jesus Nice doesn't even like white women. He doesn't even like them at all. He it's doesn't a like sucks. them at all. He doesn't follow me on Twitter. You know who does follow me? The troops. No one thinks about the troops. <laughs> <laughs> you got the dicks in the audience. Yeah, Tommy, yeah. Yeah, yeah, troops, yeah, yeah troops. Make show us your tits. Yeah. <laughs> I went to Jesus Nice's yeah. house. He has all these satin pillows. Okay, if he was dating white women, would he have that? Yeah. I'm just like, Tommy, shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. You were not in my house. Yeah. Trevor, Trevor Noah was like, what? <laughs> you went to... You was at Disney House? <laughs> in the books? Yo. I can't believe you. I can't believe you. I can't believe you. I can't believe you. <laughs> Yo. Yo. Cunt. Oh my God. <laughs> Oh, we're just flaming oh, everyone on the show now, huh? Yeah, fuck Before it. Before it was cool because like you could just say wild shit about a celebrity and I was like, yo, guess who's going to be on the show tomorrow? You're like, oh, hey, oh, you doing? hey. hey. <laughs> nah, remember when I called you Swagulous McGee? Uh, yeah. Nah, that was nah, just that was good. Was I feel like Kevin Durant, his arm is long enough to like choke, us out? choke a nigga out from, from far. Yeah. Like before we could even reach up and be like, fucking now nah, you got to hit the nigga first. Nah. Like he's already choking you. I'm just going to, I want to make everyone claro if you attack me. I will destroy whatever it is that you use to create, use, get money. So mm-hmm. if a basketball player attacks us on the show, I'm wowing at the kneecap. Oh, yeah. All day. All day. All day. All day. Like, oh, yeah. Remember when, people, when uh, Stone Cold used to have like the brace on his kneecap and then like people would fight him and like, yep. take the chair and bang it on and his knee and shit. He'd be like, ah, ah, my knee. If you're a baseball player, yep. uh, listen, I'm going to put your arm in the figure oh, four leg lock. We're going to do the drop oh. kick on it. If you're an author, we're going to take the fucking ball hand and be like, what happened? Dude, right why are you right with nickel? And then throw your laptop in the toilet. You know what I mean? If and the external hard drive. Yeah. <laughs> if you write Broadway plays, we're going to take away your fucking chorus lines. CD yeah, album. that's right. We'll take away your trash can so you can't remake. A... And your chai tea. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we got, oh, we got his threats, man. The Bronx ain't popping like this to be. Friel Chapo. Is he still in jail? He's in court in New York. Did you see Kodak Black got a year in jail? Yeah, that sucks. I mean, well, yeah. No, he, yeah. Listen, he was wilding. He was wilding. He was wilding. And then Trina tweeted out, free Kodak Black, and everyone was like, nah. Nah, I don't free that nigga. Can't free But hey. Him. He's there on like a sex charge or some shit. Oh, he oh, is? Oh, he violated his probation off of like a sex charge or some shit. Like, how you Yo, listen, up, sex like, charges, like, this is the thing with sex charges. I don't speak on those, man. Like, I, not that I don't speak on those, but it's like, I'm not going to be like free the ni- free the homie if niggas caught up on like a rape charge. If you robbed somebody, if you did a burglary, if you sold bricks, you know what I mean? If you shot a nigga you had beef with, it's free the homie all day. If you did something <laughs> related to sexual assault, yeah. I got to keep quiet on that one. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like That's the best way to move. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Don't be out here. Picking up your rapey homie. You know what I'm saying? And if you had a rapey homie, first of all, that shouldn't be a homie. Yeah. Like, I would hate to hang out with somebody. Somebody's like, yo, that nigga's wild rapey. And I'm like, yeah. Dog. Just how that nigga be. Dog. Yo, I'm not going to use no names. Mm -hmm. Because, like, this might not even make it because it's wild. So then don't do it. (laughs) How about that? How about you make it easier to edit the show? Absolutely. Just like waste everyone's time with that story. Do you know what? It's a good one. I'll tell you in the car. Girl was like, yo, this one time we like chopped this girl up, but yo, make sure to edit this shit out. 
Yo, I thought there was protesters. Niggas yeah, like, fuck y'all! Yeah. Like, Yo. Are you trapping, are you trapping like, women Yo. out, you motherfuckers? Like, Yo, take the podcast. <laughs> you guys can't see it. There's a big window where someone just held up like a big piece of paper. I couldn't see yeah. it. So I was like, damn, they found out. The problematic light just turned into the on-air light. It was like, for Peter, this one. <laughs> Peter found out. They was like, oh, we heard the early episode about the pit bull lifting weights. <laughs> <laughs> I think they really do that. Yeah, I think they really do that. We're protesting. <laughs> also, bacon, egg, and cheese. How about the vegan bacon, egg, and yeah. cheese? Jesus. How about not? No. Don't ever disrespect me. If Poppy you know ever, Poppy would be, Poppy, Poppy would make that for you. No. If you ask for it, he'd be like, Poppy, you're he the boy. He's going to call you a homosexual. No, Poppy. And not in a cool way. Yeah, nah. <laughs> it's true. And you'd be like, that's Poppy. That's an outdated slur. Why would you, why would you use that? Why would you use that But term? they wouldn't even know because... They're from Minnesota and they don't know. So, Papa Ooh. Papi, uh, the dude that's ordering the vegan bacon egg and cheese, because oh, yeah. you or I would never no, order a vegan egg and cheese. You. Oh, if it was they us? Just oh, like, yeah. You just hear whatever music, you hear like the black rob playing in the back of the bodega, like, <laughs> so scratch, like, yeah. You, yeah. You, you okay? Tu, Papi. Everyone just stop and look at you. The fucking cat turned around, like, <laughs> oh. <laughs> the Papi. Homeless, the guy stocking the sodas just drops one. It's like, like it's slow motion. It's fizz everywhere. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Papi just look at you, like, Papi, uh, you like uh, Chupi Chupi? Yeah, you I don't see know. mad doves come out. Like, <laughs> <laughs> just a wild John Wolf face off shit. There's a kid holding a red balloon with one tear come down, like, yes. yes. Jesus. <laughs> Believe him. Yeah. The sellout of Jesus Night. I cannot just, believe. It's a flash. It flashes in black and white. You just see me on a cross in a Pele Pele. Like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> and Cardi B is the Virgin Mary. She's like, oh. Yeah. Oh. listen, I'll make this. Oh, wait the fuck. What kind of award do you win for art? For uh, like an artsy movie like that? Is that like a uh, spirit award or IRC? Uh, is it can? Spirit, but you probably, yeah, no, you probably want that can. The Palm yeah, Door? Yeah, can. Yeah. yeah. I'd sell it for something. Yes. We're fucking doing all that. Yeah. Palm Door, you know what I'm saying? What, what's the name of it? The Savage. The savage Le negro. Le savage negro. Uh, Jesus. <laughs> the savage negro. <laughs> African man dingo. Man, they got to direct the shit out of that movie, yeah. bro. <laughs> this is like a, just a wild problematic shit. This is me and Susan Sarandon. She's a wild black face and shit. And she's doing a wop. Susan Sarandon, Millie Wop and shit. Yo, with a belly on. I'm naked and I'm holding two watermelons behind her. Everyone's like, what's the vision? I'm like, Miro explain. <laughs> Uh, well, I feel like artistically, is- it's just, you know, uh, an expression of this, the way that the portrayal of, you know, uh, in America. We have, like, a private screening, and then, like, the next scene is me <laughs> juggling chicken, and you have, like, Chris, Crystal and Maxie Waters in the back, like, oh, hell no! <laughs> is this nigga juggling chicken? I just do a cartwheel naked through the back with, like, holding four chicken wings, like, yeah! Oh. <laughs> it's very oh, problematic scene. It's, like, four black women's hair. And it's like a white lady's hair, and I'm like, duck, duck, duck. Le goose. Le goose. Le goose. Le goose. Le good hair. Le good. I was like, ah. Uh. <gasps> <laughs> Sir? I was like, ah. Uh. Uh. I am doing a 24 hour live stream on Instagram Live where we were doing a live viewing of Le Savis Negro Jesus. <laughs> Oh my God. It's me, me, it's me, and me, and Ke- me and Connor and Katy Perry. <laughs> just very bad. Real, real she's, like, she's like, I love this movie. It's amazing. I told all my niggas to see it. I'm like, Katie, Yo, K- Katie, 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 Katie Wallace. Fuck, man, I told go you. The, go, go play with the 12 foot torch. Come on, man. I told what you, what you only in the green room, bitch. Fuck. What's wrong with you? Fuck is wrong. Let's have you, nigga. Coming to the Beacon Theater. Yeah, yo. It's right. Stephanie Mills. <laughs> Soon as I get home. I'm like, that is not in the fucking movie. It's not a stop, man. You do this every time, Steph. Mm. Goddamn. <laughs> Tyrese is like, can I be in it? No, Tyrese. This nigga's already like auto written in. He's, He's like, like yeah, Tyrese as himself. <laughs> <laughs> I brought my own props. <laughs> yeah. Just opens with a monologue of him in the turban. He was like, in Africa, we was pharaohs because. We had sand. Just like dropping sand out of his hand. I'm like, this, is, this isn't deep at all. This is, bro, this is, this is like, we worship hotel. cats. This is hotel. And one. now we call ourselves cats because we worship ourselves as black men. Knowledge is the meow mix that we all. 
<laughs> fuck you talking about, nigga? <laughs> Are you giving up books on a fancy feast that we must all eat? Yeah, this motherfucker has shit. <laughs> I want you to stop chasing hoes and chase yarn balls that are opportunity. Like, what? <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> Yo, when well, he wrote that fucking book, he's written multiple books, I feel yes. right? Yeah. I don't know if he wrote that or other people have written books and Tyrese put his name on it. Right, yeah, absolutely. But yeah. But he's fucking, your man, at one point he dropped the book and it made Oprah's book list. Mm-hmm. And the nigga went on Twitter and was like, man, I'm just so happy to be mentioned as a celebrated author um, um uh, you know blah 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 but he spelled author like arthur hey. <laughs> like the name and i was like bro how can you be an author how could you be a nigga that writes books when you don't even know how to spell the word that means a motherfucker who writes books yeah, you see how messy oprah is oprah's like yo i'm not in a happy relationship with a male you're not gonna be in a happy relationship with a male. let me boost this book <laughs> gail you saw what i did uh-huh. <laughs> turn the hot tub back on <laughs> Shout out to Oprah. Yo. Oprah gonna have us on her ranch. She's gonna be cleaning the gun. Like, yeah. I heard your little podcast. Yeah. I mean, just have mad guns out that she's cleaning. Yeah. Like, she's like, yeah. Yo. Should be funny sometimes. Should be funny, but sometimes, you know, y'all go a little, you know, look, uh, eating gale from the back. Oh. Shit. No, no, no. My bad. But no, that's not how you said it, man. Like, uh, How'd you say it, man? Uh, uh, say it. Say it, man. Say it, man. Say it, man. Say it, Say it. You got a lot of jokes on it when you're in yeah, Red Bull Studio. Yeah, no, I just do it a little different because it's, like, um, it's like from the from the back. You know? Oprah, why do you have seven guns on the table? Uh, pick one. <laughs> For what? Are we going to... Uh, that's the one I'm going to shoot you with oh. and bury you in my vegetable Yo, <laughs> No, nah, I mean, no, nah, no. Nah, well. Can't lock the door. No! Nah! <laughs> <laughs> Can't lock the door. Can't lock the door. Can't the door. Can't lock the door. Yo. Oh shit! Uh, don't kill us, Oprah. Love us. Don't kill us. Yeah, give us some money. Take yo, us big to, uh, us up. If we, if Oprah bigs us up, mm-hmm. yo, we got Pharrell. Yeah, B- Pharrell bigs us up. Mm-hmm. A lot of people big us up. If Oprah bigs us up, it's over. You niggas cannot look me in my eyes. I'm wearing sunglasses 24 hours a we day. We just need to be on Sna- uh, inst- on Snapchat with LeBron listening to music like mm-hmm. 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 drinking a little Chardonnay. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? His house and shit. Uh huh. Should be lit. Yo, LeBron, how at us, man? How at us? We, we fuck, fuck with you. I I maintain that you are the goat, fam. Mm-hmm. Of all time. Even D list of uh, basketball players. If yeah, you want to yeah. hang with us. Yo, um, David Lee, holla at us, I guess. You um, know, uh, what's that guy's name? The Rooster? Uh, oh, yo, Gallinari, holla at us, man. We're going to get some uh, little Jamal pan Crawford. pasta. Jamal Crawford, holla at your boys. What are you doing? You're not doing yo, that. Yo, Nate. Holla Nate, you it. probably, if you can hear us in China, if we're not blocked in China, holla at us. Dominique huh? Wilkins, holla at us. Yo, Dominique Wilkins looks like he could fucking drink the shit out of some kind of here. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I still got Charles Oakley's number, but he never answered my text. I'm, I'm afraid to text him again because I feel like if I text him, he goes, you gotta text him like press him. And then like, Yo, who the fuck stop fucking texting me? Yeah, yeah, no, I'm no, like, no. You could text him and then get him tight, and you gotta link up, and I will just be in the cut. And if he tries to hook off, I just sneak him jump. like whoop. You know what I'm saying? Charles Oakley With like a pipe or something. Both of us. Yeah, and somebody. Yeah. Then we gotta use a weapon. It. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't mean punch a nigga. I, bro, if I punch Charles Oakley, it would be just to say Could that I punched Charles Oakley because he would fucking destroy me. Imagine we fighting Charles Oakley. We fuck around. He hits his head on the curb and. Dies, now we gotta go to jail for <sighs> killing Charles, Charles Oakley? Oakley, nigga. Yo, I would just jump in traffic. Like, yo, ah! <laughs> low key though. Plot twist: James Dolan would then make us like executive of mm-hmm. basketball operations mm-hmm. he <laughs> for the Knicks. He like, ow. <laughs> Thank you for doing my light work. <laughs> you did exactly, exact, exactly. These are true fans. All right, this is fan appreciation night. I just want to give a heart so thanks and congratulations to uh, Dees and Mero. For helping uh, an alcoholic, quite frank, frankly, with uh, life problems, and uh, he's now they're gonna help me break this kazoo record. One, two, three. <laughs> we just say that bad side, like, yo, damn, food <laughs> traders. <laughs> Everyone's like, boo. They show us on the show, which I'm like, boo. Give it up for Jesus and Mero. <laughs> Fire those assholes. I'm like, nah, like, come on. Bro, we like y'all. They're like, like boo, get no, off there. And Zor- Endor is like, Y'all niggas suck. I'm like, yo, can't yo, you can't even word. say that, nigga. What the fuck is wrong with you, Ansel? <laughs> Boom. 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 Thank you, Charles Oakley. <laughs> Our shows are sold out. This is mad niggas in Nick jerseys. We're like, uh oh. We're doing the mad insincere, like R.I.P. Charles yo, Oakley tribute and shit. He was a great player. He was he was strong underneath the boards. And, you know what I'm saying? Like, but uh, the hands was too much for that nigga. He couldn't hang. Not, you know what I'm saying? Run up and get done. You that's know what right. It is? So anybody else? Uh, anybody else wanted? Sam will snap this ugly nigga yeah. at the funeral. I w- <laughs> nigga, we litty too titty. Yo, Chris Dudley, pull up. <laughs> I dare you. They're like most hated. Nick fans ever. <laughs> <laughs> but the thing is, like, James Dolan would bang with us, so we could oh, go so to the and shit, the actual Nick's Bruh, hate us and come shit. Come on. If we did something wild problematic, he would just make us in charge of the Liberty. You know what I'm saying? That's it. 
It's a picture of us, James Dolan, and Isaiah Thomas. Not the cool Isaiah Thomas, but the yeah, bad Isaiah Thomas. The, yeah, Zeke. Yeah, they're doing the logo on the fucking thing right now. It's mesmerizing. Oh, it's the Red Bull Music Academy logo. Yo, shit, we lit. It's lit. Shut the Red Bull Music Academy. Yo, do it. Because they always got people mad early. They had Metro booming like early, early in the game. Early. So shut the mix pack. Also, you walk by somebody here and you're like, yo, who is this wing ding? And like four years later, like the number one selling. You're like, oh, Ibita. yo, you know what? I didn't even realize when we did the Terrio shit on, uh, you know, D's vs. Mm-hmm. We, and we walked around the office. Mm-hmm. There's a dude who came out in the office who is now a uh, pretty successful like rapper guy. He's like doing. So, What's I, his name? Uh, Amine? 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 He's the model for Kanye. He got the yeeks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but shout out to that dude. Oh, you know what I'm shout out to him. Shout out to him being successful. You know what I mean? Even though we're successful <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Oh, uh, nigga ripped it. He ripped the decal. Uh, shit, oh, no, he did it. Reveal. Oh, oh shit. Yeah. Yeah. He's like, what are you clapping for? I do this shit every week. Every fucking day. I'm tired bad. of this shit. I feel like that's how pilots feel when you land a plane and the niggas clap. One day a pilot's gonna come out like, motherfucker, this is the 1,000th flight I've landed. Why the fuck are you clapping? Oh, Bobby, because it's 1,000. Happy birthday to you, Bobby. Yo. Let it like go. Land in the fucking jet bull flight in DR every day. Just get off the fucking plane. I don't even get to hang out here. Motherfucker, like, and also, I, I don't want to say nothing. Why don't you people buy suitcases? <laughs> you can't be going to DR with half mark shopping bags. Half mark's not even open anymore. Yo, shout out to all that little male personnel <laughs> who be pulling up to the airport with the wild, you know that fucking bag, the shit that you buy, at the, the shit that's like weird, like, it's like a woven, woven yes. thing, like. <laughs> This is Samsonite. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. Auntie. Yo, a nigga named Samson made that. How you got four wedding dresses, a hot plate, and a watermelon in there? That's, Bro, that's not carry that's on. That's not carry on. TSA is like, ah, oh, these these items not even on the. It's bruh. What is this? A, My a mom yard? used to throw a fit when they used to be like, "Yo, you can't put that in carry on." She'd be like, "Why not? Huh? Why not? They pay for three suitcases." And she's over here arguing with niggas, and then they, it's finally she's like trying to stuff a fucking guitar into a suitcase and shit. My father tried. To take a chainsaw on carry on. <laughs> <laughs> I swear on my mother's life. But he took off the chain. Oh, so it was safe. <laughs> He's like, yo, TSA is always fucking with me. I'm like, no, TSA is actually doing their job. Job, job. So what time? They're not gonna let fucking Jason like, Voorhees like, on the flight. I'm not, if, I get, <laughs> if I get on the plane yeah. and I'm gonna put my gym bag in the overhead compartment and I see a John Deere lawnmower, <laughs> you're dragging me off that flight, yeah, United. Like that, that should be a checked. Yeah, he don't know what he's like. It's called carry on because I could carry the shit on. I'm like, that's no, right. That's no, for like MacBooks no. and shit. That shit's not for gardening equipment. He want to bring yeah. like a tree stump remover and shit. <laughs> oh, shout out to you, pops. Yeah, shout to you. Shout, shout to the guy. Just trying to save twenty three dollars and shit. Yo, flying with a chainsaw at three twenty five a.m. Very frugal. It's a LaGuardia Airport on Tuesday morning. I'm like, how much was it? Flight fifty five dollars. Yeah, I'm gonna pay fifty five too much. <laughs> He's like, nah, I, had yeah. to, I was like, it was a direct flight. He's like, nah, they rerouted me through Idaho. I'm I don't like, know why? how, why? how? He's like, I've been flying for three days. <laughs> <laughs> I saved five dollars. Yo, I took a flight to DR one time with a layover in Toronto. And then I looked at the map and I was like, how why? Is this, how is that possibly cheaper? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like, why did I go all the way over there? <laughs> like, what the fuck is this? When I had that terrible office job, they were sending me from New York to Cleveland. Why we had to stop in like Virginia or somewhere? And I was like, that's the total the opposite direction. way. What is happening? I could literally, I could walk to Cleveland faster than this. Oh, Damn, man. I think it's wild. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, good times, good times we had, good times we lost. Yeah, along the way, way coming yeah. to the plate, Aaron George. <laughs> Uh, I just want to thank my Lord and Savior for all the visit. Uh, the umpire's like, there's no mic on, you asshole. We're judging. <laughs> We're judging. Hey. I want to judge, judge it with you. Hey, I'm Mike. Uh, first time, long time. Um, This Aaron Judge guy. I thought I was a big fan of him uh, when I thought he was white. And now apparently I see that he passes the Dutch on the left-hand side. And I just think that's going to affect uh, his batting. Um, Also, I think, you know, what if we trade uh, Aaron Judge uh, for Henrik Ludquist? I'm going to hang up in here. What you got to say? Thanks. Yeah, well. First of all, Steve, let me get another that coke. Let me tell you something about this guy. Aaron Judge is a good guy. Goes to church. Like him. Don't like him because he's black. I like the captain. <laughs> Derek Jeter's a nice guy. He was, But he was more, uh, you know, black. He was less black. The less black you are, the more successful I think you could be. That's just me, the Pope. 
Steve, give me another Diet Coke. Uh, whatever your name is from Long Island, uh, the trade is stupid. Go fuck your mother. Goodbye. Oh, okay. Uh, Mike. Uh, yeah, yeah, Mike. Hi, hi, hi. Jo Joey from Elizabeth. Big fan. Hey, Joey. How you doing, Joey? I, I mean, I, I, What's I, the question, Joey? Get to the question, Joey. I, 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 all the time that I've been going to Yankee games. That's not a question. Keep quiet, please. I, I'm in Fenway. I don't hear anyone ever using You know, I don't hear anyone using the N-word. Let me tell you, this is, like I'm very passionate. Of, I feel like a lot of the, the black people, they use the N-word all the time. And if yeah. they had their own, yeah. you know, why is there a BT and there's no uh, yeah. W? -E absolutely, absolutely. I, I, I mean, and Adam Jones, um, I mean, the original guy, Adam, was white. So if anything, he's appropriating white culture. That's absolutely correct. Okay. Well, let me tell you something. I get this grinds my gears because what if there was a show called Whitish? That's what I'm just saying. What if there was a whites only fountain? Yeah. You know? <laughs> What about that? Then what would they say? They would be irate. They would be up in arms. So that's what I say. Okay. You know? You know, and I'd just like to say that affirmative action has ruined Major League Baseball. Absolutely. Every team is absolutely. Black. Absolutely. It's like the universal fucking. So oh, Scott, I'm sorry. Yeah. Let I'm me sorry. tell you. No, you're absolutely right. Sorry, Let me tell you I something. Curse on a bar I actually I agree with you. I actually agree with you. I love the Boston guys, the great guys. I love it. Did you see their new album, White Boy Joy? Yeah, it's amazing. They're like the White Heim. Shout out to Kevin. I love him. He hates oh, Juice. Yeah, I listen. Uh, uh, but listen. When you play baseball, you got to be white. <laughs> <laughs> That's the inside of baseball for dummies. <laughs> it's 300 pages. It's just written like really Bro, big. I just imagine him like watching, like actually watching games. And then like, let's say fucking like Gary Sanchez hits a walk off home run. And then they got to interview Gary Sanchez in the fucking dugout. It's and, like, and it's in Spanish. It's I just like, imagine like the steam uh, coming out his ears. Like him being like, ah. She's like, no, I'm going to change. I got to, I got to fucking read I got to go. Now. I got to go fucking learn a new language just to find out how this idiot feels about hitting a home run. This is crazy. I'm about to be a fan of a team that has no Latino plays. Uh, uh. Is there any that exist? Probably not. Damn. Steve White. from Long Island, go fuck yourself. White genocide. <laughs> white genocide. It's sad because the only people still really watching baseball are like old white people I mean, and they don't see themselves on the field no more. That sucks. So. Sorry, yeah. I, mean, Sorry yeah. I mean, you see yourself everywhere else. Damn, son. That's why I don't be listen, white people, I love y'all, you know what I'm saying? Like, shout out to y'all. Like, I love everybody, blah blah blah. I don't see color. Yeah, 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 whatever, yeah, yeah. Blah blah blah. blah, 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 blah yeah, yeah. Unity, all that uh, shit. Unity, blah blah blah. Peace. Equal, yeah, King all all that, you already know. All lives matter. Yeah, heritage night, yeah, blah. But like you see y'all niggas see yourselves everywhere, bro. Yeah, Come on. Y'all like, good? Y'all good, bro. Not only that. White people are like the Yankees. They yeah, had a good run. You had a you great had a run, run, bro. Enjoy your legacy. Rings. Enjoy your legacy. Can't and let forever, dog. Yeah, bro. Listen, you know the Cubs just won it. It might yeah, be time. Might you know what I'm saying? Time. Like, Are the black people the Cubs? Yeah. We've <laughs> <laughs> been losing for years. <laughs> yes. <laughs> just started trying to win. Well, we thought saying? we had up next. Yeah. Uh, I guess Asian people were like the fucking Tampa. Or Tampa or whatever, <laughs> the race. Listen, we just, listen, we're going to the pennant this year. <laughs> We got the strong, we got the strong starting <laughs> rotation. We got D-Ray, we you got Neta. Good you offense. Saying? Keep those arms straight. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We got, uh, who else we got? We got uh, Sean King coming out the bullpen. <laughs> <laughs> we got Creaky left, you know what I'm saying? If they keep you know, accordion shots. Yeah. I, think, I, think we got, I, I feel like we're going at least to the semis this year. Uh, do you know what I mean? <laughs> White people got Trump though. I mean, that's listen. Yeah, 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 he's, yeah, yeah. He's, he's getting the side young. Yeah, <laughs> yo, easily, easily. easily. His easily. ERA is crazy. He's like no hitters all week. <laughs> yo, his ERA has earned racism average. <laughs> <Woo>! <laughs> Flames. Oh shit. <laughs> yo. Oh shit. What's Trump's walk up music? Um. They're proud to be an American, because I know at least it I know. Be some yeah, or like something wall related, mm -hmm. like build a wall or fucking. Wall. What's that song like? Uh, uh, get the fucking Mexicans out of here. I think it's uh, how it goes. I don't think that's <laughs> 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 yo, shout out to all my Chicanos, yo. They show mad love in, in LA. LA. Oh, wow. Down, man. Wow. Shout out to y'all. I felt bad for our jokes, but then I don't feel bad for any of our jokes. You know, y'all niggas love them. <laughs> Fuck that. No, they were the Mexicans holding this hand. Shout out to y'all. Shout out to Mexico. Viva la raza. La raza. You know what I mean? Damn. I mean, listen, we all had a good run. This is our last episode. <laughs> <laughs> I mean. But Yo. We said at the beginning, we said we were only doing 63 episodes. We said it in the first episode. Did we? No. <laughs> Fuck. Yo, because I yo, niggas say shit all the time, and then it come, people tell me that I said some shit, and that you like, said word? some shit. I'm like, oh, word? Okay. No, but we sometimes, oh, you know who you predicted was going to die, and they died? Who? Prince. 
Oh, the nigga died? Yeah. Oh, shit. Fuck. Yo, we got to end this shit. Yeah. Sad. <laughs> It's sad. But you know what's not ending? Diaz and Mero. That's right. Monday through Thursday. We just celebrated our episode. That's we right. On Monday. Yeah. Check that out. The Black Bottle Boys is in the building. <laughs> As always, coming to you live from Red Bull Studios. Crystal clear Crystal clarity. Crystal clarity. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? We got the podcast. We got that art, nigga. Yeah. Oh, and the Cinco de Mayo, yo. Shout out to all my Mexicanos. Uh, all my Chicanos. Chicano, all my Mexicans. You know what I'm saying? All my white people pretending to be Mexican. And all my NYU students that will end up floating in a river tonight. Hey. Because you do not know how to drink. And this is your first time in New York. All right. And you think five shots of Patron straight to the face is the way to celebrate hey, Mexican independence. If you drop your phone on the tracks, leave that shit. Leave it. <laughs> your parents will buy you a new one, Megan. <laughs> There's no reason for you to go face to face with the F train at Second Avenue. No, 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 no. And everyone else on the platform is too drunk to help you. Yo, you are gonna lose that fight. They're not even helping you. This is yelling at you like, get up, get up, Megan, get off the train bed, you bitch. You fucking, you're, you're so dumb. Get up. The train's coming. You know why she can't get up? Because she's a slut. She's a stupid. You're such a slut, man. But she slept with Brian, and now she her slept with Brian. Heavy, and now she can't get off. Oh the my god. The train hits her. Oh my god. What a slut. And the train hits her. You feel that? Train hits her. It's like thirteen things. It's like this is where your tape starts. <laughs> That's for all my millennials. Yo, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's your boy Jesus Nice, yeah. aka Jesus Nice, aka Young Chipotle, aka Pocket Steve Fat Lecterio, aka Chris Sass, Bush Lincoln, aka Eli Lippy. Butcher, Butcher's Gully, so bad I know you have a young day. Party Young Hot Take. Disney for you go. Mr. Nando's around the middle of the going off. Woo! Yeah! Got a little jumble there, a little train traffic. Mm -hmm. Mikhail going off the Juve boss. MC Little Goon Goon Pull up yeah. for 40 with your shorty, aka Don't Talk to Me in the Uber Pool. I don't, don't know you at all. Also, it's a surge. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'm paying extra money. I'm tight. I'm tight right now. Duration of my plus one got a plus one. So don't make a fuss, son. All right? Yeah. I, listen. Yeah. I don't even, I my name's not on the list. I don't even care I'm coming through with five people now. Front row. 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 Yeah, from the Neptune. Yeah, yeah him. Tell him D he knows. Deez and Meryl from the other tone. Yes, we, he said. We yes, were there yeah. in LA. Uh, the dude, remember weeks. the bodega guys? He said we were brilliant. Yeah. I have fo Look, can I, can I pull up the photo? I, I'm going to reach him on Twitter. Uh, What's his uh, uh, Wi Fi? Oh, he don't follow me? Oh, damn. damn. Jesus Rossi, the Jamaican <laughs> Jermaine Avocado Toast. Young Pow, the Ghost of Mufasa. Mufasa. I need you to get the AR 15 Simba. Just kill all these niggas, man. All these niggas, all these niggas. Kill me, nigga. They niggas try to flame me, twin. Bust your shots. Also, also, why were we not picked to play Timon and Pumbaa? Yo, first and Huge foremost, oversight. incredibly terrible. I mean, shout out to Seth Rogen. Shout out to Seth Rogen you know because he follows me. He's got, got mad caked up and it's I want cool. to be in a terrible movie where people put cum on their face as a joke. Exactly. But you know what? We would have made great Timon's approval. Just Let's putting that out there. Just putting that out there. Let me know for the sequel. We're going to be very bitter and talk about this for the next five years. So, Absolutely. Right. Yo, Chakuni, we're out the coonery. AK Chili Limon, left handed reliever for the Yankees. Can't locate. Do you remember that time we were in Fenway and they called us Moon Crickets and do Platinos at us? Uh, oh. And I took the Platinos home and gave them to my wife and she fried <laughs> them up. <laughs> Vice game, Maku Zaka. Three phone jokes. You say Makina. J. Chuckles. Stanley Cups. The human Dr. Bonner's label. Dilute. 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 So your pum pum don't burn if you do it no. as douche. Dino DiCaprio. Mr. 240 because I like my Pinot Blurry. Yeah. DJ Woolai, AK. You're listening to Wash FM. Up next, we have 50 minutes of Jermaine Jackson. Yeah. AK. The Ja Majesty mix. Ooh. The Curry Goat. <laughs> Deezer Spicer. Jamal Hashburn. The Bronxeline Dion. Rare Nephew's Nephew. The Moreno. Your Cat Contano. The human meme word to Ja. Young oh. Erwan. The racist provocateur, Henrik Budquist. Ooh. The black Asiatic addict who crack your back like an automatic craft match. Mr. La Marina and Mesh Marina went fresh misdemeanor in the cold demeanor, a.k.a. Yo, problematic, babe. I gotta get Mary J. Blige to make a song. Like oh, she's gonna do it. Problematic, babe. Oh, man. About how you in love with a nigga he's just doing you wrong yeah. and shit. Nigga, like, burning up your table with roach clips and shit. And then she's gonna be like, fuck you, can fuck do. You. He's my babe. He's my babe. <laughs> and he hits these walls. <laughs> Uh, uh, good motherfucker. And you know who it is. Who it Episode is. 62. It's your boy, 63. God damn, I'm a smack. It's what a human direct flap, you know what I'm saying? Go AKA Curve Gotti, AKA Tris Khalif, huh? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? AKA Skirt Loader, you know what I'm saying? AKA I know fucking baby. I fucking man. My nigga, check out my dad. You know what I'm saying? Check out the guest list. My frong is from Santo Domingo. So check the guest list, nigga. Because my name is almost certainly on there. It might be my government. Like, I got my license if you want to check it. You know what I'm saying? Like, but I'm definitely. This license expired. Do you have another? Nah, but it's my name is on there. I got my debit. Okay, this is my wife's. Oh, shit. Fuck out of here. I'm getting there, nigga. Step down. I'm not fucking side. Fuck that. Yo, because you know why, nigga? I'm the fucking dad of the year, aka Ben Smith. Be on ball. I've been getting smacked while y'all been being whack. You know what I'm saying? Feel the ass taste in the Dominican. Da, da, da. You know what I'm saying? Ben Boston, my hands are gifted. I will turn your brain into a baked good and then back into a brain so that you can understand what cake thinks like. 
I'll open your fucking medicine cabinet, so watch your benzos, nigga, because it's the Zen, man. It's gonna bada bada weed, You know what I'm saying? Blem de la blem. You know what I'm saying? Baby Newport, Tom Brazy, your girl got my balls type deflated, and you are under investigation. Swipe my card again, because there's definitely money on it. You know what I'm saying? It's Nino Brown, the East Street, my Stevie B. The plant and supernova in the sky. One day you will find me ringside with Jesus, eating Zannies and drinking. Liquor that's questionable. You know what I'm saying? Barbellos Anthony dropping 62 on the strip tonight. And if you see me at Target, dog, please respect my agency. Approach me like you would Ling Ling at the zoo. You understand? Porque llegó el hijo de Tito y FIFA, papi, es maduro, maduro con un mojón de robocó, más caliente que la tola, más amado Siri arriba, que lo que pongan en flow, que pronto toca el patio, prende la juca. My friend says it's a dude out his headphones. <laughs> like, you find that everywhere. Go. The World Baseball Classic is your rail. That's stupid. <laughs> what, what, what team are you playing for? <laughs> All these players, they play for their respective countries, but they play in America. <laughs> they <laughs> Yo. As always, shout out to the sponsors Red Bull. Yes, sir. Big Baller Brand. Big sneakers, Baller Brand. <laughs> and Flippy's Vienna Sausages. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this weekend, we got big can. time sponsors now, boy. Big time, listen. <laughs> Ain't no broke boy shit no more. It's, late. it's quiet for you, Narcan. This weekend, and take some time out to enjoy time with your family. Yes. And always get a can of Vienna sausage and guzzle it. <laughs> Lahaim to life. Because all things are possible through him. More fire for your head top, so watch how you speak on our name, you know? More Christ for your life piece. <laughs> so watch how you read the Bible. That's Pastor Jesus, Minister Miro. We're out. Peace. Stay blessed. <laughs>